Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel, and this is the numbers for the versions of Windows that people are using. We now have the new numbers. They have been released. Uh, this comes from Add Duplex, and the numbers come from 5,000 apps that actually report the version of Windows 10. So uh, this is, of course, Windows 10 only. Uh, if you want to have numbers of Windows in general, these usually are at the beginning of each month. So we have uh, Windows 10, the May 2019 update, that's version 1903, at 50.7%. So half of you out there are in the version of Windows that's about a year old. Uh, 1909, the November 2019 update is at 28.2% .2 right now. So it, isn't, it didn't gain that much, it went from like 22 to 28%. Uh, so it's not really gaining momentum a lot. And, you know, this was expected when Microsoft announced that there would not be any more uh, shoving in your face of a Windows version and that you have to install it yourself. It, uh, of course, meant that there would be probably several versions of Windows 10 that would linger along a little bit. Then 1809 at 11.4%. And the one interesting thing is uh, 1803, 1709, that kind of popped up a little. And it's suspected it's because a lot of people are um, at home now and actually firing up their PCs that maybe they haven't used in a long time. So um, kind of interesting to see that, you know, the what's happening around the world is having an effect on the numbers. So that means that, of course, if we round that up, that uh, the 2019 updates both together, May and November, make up for 79% of all Windows versions. So uh, that's good news for Microsoft because of, you know, what we have in numbers. And uh, for the rest, people, pretty much the things have been uh, staying stable, uh, insiders at 0.6 and so on. So not a big move, but um, at least, you know, um, most people are in a modern version. If you add 1809, that is still supported for a couple of months. We're at um, 80, we're, in, we're past the 90% mark, which is um, pretty incredible. 90% uh, of all PCs are on a supported version of Windows 10 right now. So that's also good news. And uh, remember that, you know, some of the numbers here might be from Enterprise. They do have extended support for older versions. So the numbers are here, and uh, they're uh, interesting to look at. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thanks for watching.